This is cell phone video showing the moments a seventh grade student was attacked in school. The alleged result of mistaken identity. It happened at the Morton McMichael School in Mantua on Tuesday. Weeks after that girl says her laptop was stolen. As she tells it, what the thief then did with that computer landed her in the middle of that violent melee. Live outside school district headquarters tonight is Action News reporter Maggie Kent. Maggie, you spoke to the student in the middle of this today and her mother. We did, Brian. That video is now part of a police investigation being conducted by Southwest detectives. My head hit the wall. They were pulling my legs, kicking, stumping. This is video of seventh grader Soraya Hayward assaulted by six students at Morton McMichael School in Mantua. It's now at the center of a police investigation into simple assault by six children, four girls and two boys, all 13 to 14 years old. There were some kids who were just stumping and yelling and screaming, and I was just like, this isn't going to stop. The assault left Soraya with a concussion. Her mother is left wondering where the adults were. You can actually see the teacher in the video just standing there. Like she's not doing anything to help at all. While my daughter is being attacked. Soraya says her school laptop was stolen by a classmate. During that time, inappropriate messages were sent from her account to teachers and other students which led to a misunderstanding and a beating. It was a lot happening at that moment and I didn't really know what to do. The school district says we've been made aware of a video surfacing involving an incident between students that allegedly occurred at Morton McMichael School. The behavior depicted in the video is totally unacceptable. Soraya's mother says what's unacceptable is the lack of long term consequences. She was attacked and now she have to stay home and they get to continue to go about their education. That's not fair at all. The school district will not comment on the disciplinary actions taken against the students seen in that video. Nubria Haywood says she's pulling her daughter out of the school. We're live at district headquarters. Maggie Kent, Channel 6 Action News. Brian. Maggie, thank you.